Good morning, grade three students. How are you? Fine. Today we are going to solve page forty-seven. Okay, open your books on page forty-seven and let's solve the exercises. Exercise twenty. Complete the table following the example. One thousand plus nine hundred plus forty plus two. Let's see. How many zero there is in one thousand? Three zero. So I write one in the letter T H, which means thousand plus nine hundred. How many zero there is in nine hundred? Two. So I write nine in letter H, which means hundred plus forty. How many zero there is in forty? One. So I write four in letter T, which means tens. Plus two, two is staying alone. So I write two in letter O, which means ones. The number I have to compose or to collect the number one thousand nine hundred forty-two. Let's see the second one. One is ones, zero is tens, six is hundred, and three is thousand. Let's see, three thousand. How many zero? Three zero. Excellent. So three thousand plus six h and six hundred. How many zero? Two. So plus six hundred. I skip zero and move to one because zero is nothing. One. Do I have any zero? No. One is one. So plus one. I compose the number three thousand six hundred one. Let's move four thousand seventy one. One is ones. Seven is tens. Zero hundred and four is thousand. So four is thousand. How many zero? Three. Excellent. Four thousand plus. I skip zero. I move to seven. So plus seven is on letter T, which means ten. Seventy one zero plus one. Let's see the last example. Five thousand plus. Twenty plus five. Five. How many zero? Three. So I write five in the letter T H, which means thousand. Do I have here two zero? No. So I write zero on letter H, which means hundred. There is no hundred let digit. Plus twenty. I have one zero. So I write two in the letter T. Tens. And five on the letter ones. Let's compose the number five thousand twenty-five. Exercise twenty-one. Write the numbers, which mean I have to compose the number one thousand plus eight hundred plus fifty plus one. I have to write the digits thousand, hundred, tens, and ones. One is ones, five is tens, eight is hundred, and one is thousand. So one thousand eight hundred fifty-one. Let's continue. Four thousand plus six hundred plus twenty plus nine thousand hundred tens and ones. Here nine is is ones, two is tens, six is hundred. And four is thousand, so four thousand six hundred twenty-nine. Three thousand plus one hundred plus ten plus five. I write the digits thousand, hundred, tens, and ones. Five is ones. One is tens. One is hundred, and three is thousand. Three thousand one hundred fifteen. Excellent students. Last number five thousand plus nine hundred plus 
9. I write the plus 90, sorry. So let's repeat 5000 plus 90, 900 plus 90. I write the digits. Thousand, hundred, tens, and ones. Do I have here ones? No. So I write zero. Nine is tens, and nine hundred is on letter H. Hundred and five is thousand. So five thousand nine hundred ninety. Exercise 22. Complete with a suitable number 1999 and 2001. I have to write the number that is between these two numbers. 1999. What is the number that comes after 1999? I have to add 1. So 9 plus 1 equals 10, which means I write 0. How many 9s do I have here? 3. So I write 3, 0. And what is the number that comes after 1? 2. So 2,000. If you don't know the number that comes after 1,999, you have to see the number that comes before 2,001. Which means I have to subtract 1. So, 2001 minus 1, it gives 2000. Let's see the second example. 2649, I add 1 to 49. 49 plus 1 is equal 50. So, 2650. Now, 2000. What is the number that comes after 2000? I add 1, so 2000, 1. 4000. What is the number that comes after 4000? I add 1 to the 1's digit, which means 4001. 5199. I see 199. Okay, I add 1. So, I replace the 9 with 0. How many 9 do I have here? 2. So, I write 2, 0. What is the number that comes after 1? 2. So, 5,200. Same, 3,999. I, I have here 3, 9. I add 1. So, I replace with 0. 3, 0. What is the number that comes after 3, 4, which means the number that comes after 3,999 is 4,000. 2,519, I add 1 to 19, it will be 20, so 2,520. 4,999, I have here 3, 9. So I replace with 3, 0. What is the number that comes after 4? 5. So 5,000. 2,998. What is the number that comes after 8? 9. So 2,999. Exercise 24. Write in increasing order. What is the meaning of increasing order, student? Excellent. From the smaller to the bigger, which means I have to write the numbers from the smaller to the bigger. First, I have to circle the thousand digits in each number. So 3810, I circle 3, I circle 1, 4, 3, 2, 5. Then, let's see which one is the smaller number. 1. Excellent. So, I write 1,565. I cross 1,565. Let's see the rest. Which number is the smaller? 2. Excellent. 2,050. I cross 2,050. Which number is the smaller here? Pay attention very well. I have 2, 3. So, I underline 
the hundred digit. I have eight and six. Which one is the smaller? Six. Excellent. So I write three thousand six hundred fifty and three thousand eight hundred ten, and I cross. The rest is four and five. The smaller is four. So four thousand seven. I cross and. 5,010. Thank you, student, for your paying attention. Please copy on your book, page 47.